Hey baby dolls, it's Brie and welcome back to my channel. So today, yes girl, today I am here with a Bath and Body Works haul. Now, I know you're probably thinking, oh, she was about to say an SAS haul. No ma'am, no ma'am. I went into the stores and the committee still has not marked those 50% down to 75, so I'm on strike till I see that 75% off over the top of those products, okay? But not all hope is lost because I got a lot of stuff that I hauled back in the day day that I never shared with you, okay? So I had started like this installment of like lost files or whatever, basically videos where I just wanted to share with you all the stuff that I hauled, but I never got to actually record the stuff, if you know what I'm saying? So today, um, I just said, well, why don't I do another Lost Files video? Because quite honestly, the stuff that I share with you today might be items that you can still see at your local outlet and stores just the same. So without further ado, let's jump into this video. So I am back. So today, as you can see, is a very chill, relaxed Sunday. Um, I didn't really do much either yesterday. Actually, when the weekend kicked off on Friday, I gave myself permission to just pretty much chill. So yesterday, I didn't do much. I just ordered Uber Eats, um, watched some movies, you guys. I indulged in a Polish boy. And if y'all don't know what a Polish boy is, you better get you one of them, okay? That's where it's at. Um, if you're not from Cleveland, maybe you don't know, but it's like a fry, like a big juicy, I mean a really meaty beef sausage. It's got um, thick cut fries, coleslaw, barbecue sauce on a toasted bun. It might not seem like it goes together, but it works. It's really good, super delicious. So had one of those, watch movies, and after I'm done with this video, I'll probably just go to Dollar Tree, get me some stuff for work so I can start my work week off right, and that's it. So um, what else did I wanna say? Make sure that you subscribe. Please make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up and let's get it. Let's get it, okay? Because I got quite a lot to show you. So this is the first bag. I want to say this stuff is from the outlet. So first thing I'm going to share with you is this antibacterial hand spray. This is in the scent A Thousand Wishes. There we go. Now it's focused. So A Thousand Wishes. I love A Thousand Wishes. I will purchase that over and over and over again. The next thing that I want to share with you is this Cinnamon and Sandalwood Essential Oil Mist. So this is pretty cool because I have to block my face out. Because now I'm able to complete the set. Gingerbread Bakery. And this is a pocket bag. So there's that. I also picked up this Aroma Oasis Pineapple Plus Lime and Eucalyptus Essential Oil Mist. So again, I was able to get the body cream during another sale and then went back and completed my set and got this. I also was able to pick up this Autumn Drive Ultimate Hydration Body Cream and the scent notes in this are gonna be Wild Raspberry, Warm Amber, and vanilla birch and this one is super super pretty i pray that that's focusing because my ring light has been like extra bright like what is going on like i feel like i could land a plane with this thing um anyway let me stay on track the next item that i want to share with you is going to be pure wonder in the fine fragrance mist form you guys and in the beginning i was totally a hater I totally was but when I know I'm wrong I can apologize I can admit my wrongs okay so I am now a fan and I have this in the fine fragrance mist form and I also have this in the perfume form so I'll go ahead and show you the perfume because it is actually in another bag down here but this is the pure wonder perfume go on and focus I hope that focuses for you guys. But yeah, this is a 1.7 ounce bottle. And quite honestly, I have been like spraying this up. So I don't even have the top on this, you guys. Again, I've had these items for, you know, quite some time. So just being honest. So there's Pure Wonder. Probably has like a little smidge of product left because I don't think, it doesn't feel like there's too much left in here. Fragrance notes are gonna be Ice Rosé, Star Jasmine, 
in warm white amber. And this one is so pretty. It's really, really, really like the type of set that you can wear every single day. I have it in a ton of forms. I have it, of course, in the fine fragrance mist form. This is like my second fine fragrance mist. I have it in the perfume like I just shared with you. I have it in the body cream. I have it in the lotion. Like, I'm just pure wondered out. I also have this in the like creamy body scrub form. So this one is great. I picked up some minis. I got this white coconut caramel fine fragrance mist. And I actually have another one in this same scent. But I was like, because I don't see this in like a full size, let me go ahead and get another one. Because in my mind, I'm like, okay, that's closer to a full size than not. As even though the fragrance notes aren't on here, this smells like exactly what you think it should smell like. This is straight up white coconut, caramel. It smells sort of white chocolate-esque. It's good. It's really, really good. So this next one is Happy Birthday, you guys. I love this one. I really, really love this one. This is straight up yellow birthday cake in a fine fragrance mist. When I smelled this initially, it was love at first to them. I was like, wow, committee, you guys have really done your thing. Like, whoever was a part of formulating this, they, they got their mind right. They got the formula right. I mean, everything is just amazing. Like, this scent smells so high-end. It smells perfumey so much to the point where... I had the fine fragrance mist, which smells good and perfumey on its own, but I'm like, nah, I actually need the perfume in this particular fragrance. So I can't wait to share this with you. This is Poppy. Poppy. Okay. So Poppy definitely got the shine it deserved during the summer months, but I feel like her wave kind of went up and then it came crashing down. Well, I'm about to make waves for her once again because it's that good. So I have it in the body lotion form come on and focus so there we go i hauled it in the shower gel form okay and i also hauled it like i said in the perfume form the fragrance notes in poppy are going to be fresh morning dew wild poppy sugar rhubarb and juicy pear fantastic 10 out of 10 would recommend look at the packaging how beautiful this is so you guys I had to bring this up super close because I couldn't really see it it was too much of a glare before but this is a 1.7 ounce bottle of pure fantastic juice I love this I cannot wait to spritz this on over and over and over again um, I think this is definitely more so like a spring summer you know sort of vibe but quite honestly it's so good like if you just want something fresh use this i love this this is so good it's like the perfect blend of fresh and floral it's amazing it is incredible the next one is actually a fragrance where i was like okay do i need to have that one eh, not so much but once I smelled it again, I'm like, it's not that bad. It's sweet, it's playful, and it's just like a girly scent. So I feel like I could layer this with other stuff and it wouldn't like get in the way of those other fragrances. So I picked up a full size Fine Fragrance Mist Pink Berry Clouds. So that's what it looks like, very cute. So the fragrance notes are gonna be Strawberry Sponge Sugar, marshmallow fluff and fresh air so I want to say I also had an offer either in my virtual wallet in my app or I might have used like an actual coupon like that comes in the mailers I can't remember all I know is I was able to get a travel size product so I went ahead and got the pink berry clouds body cream this next one, I actually have this one in a fine fragrance mist, and at some stores it had everything, but in others not so much, so I had to like go here to get the lotion, go there to get the fine fragrance mist. So anyway, now I have Orange Vanilla Twist in the body lotion form, and this one smells really good. I didn't know that I would actually like this the way that I do, but it's nice. 
So the fragrance notes are gonna be Juicy Orange, Summer Sherbet, and Vanilla Creme. So straight up orange sickle is what this one is giving. I am back with the final chapter of this Lost Files video. Um, and thank you for sticking around this long. So let's jump into it. So this is Poppy, as I was explaining earlier, but in the fine fragrance mist form. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And if you look there at the bottom, you guys, that stem is green. It's so pretty. It actually looks like a plant stem. It looks like the stem coming from the actual flower that's on the packaging. So I love that. Super pretty. Into the Night Glowing Body Scrub. So we all know Into the Night. This is a grown and sexy fragrance. So the actual fragrance notes are going to be Raspberry Noir, Amber Crystals, Velvety Rose Petals, Creamy Patchouli, and Mocha Musk. So you guys, super quick story time. I got this fresh coconut colada fine fragrance mist. You guys, I actually had done inventory and I'm like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna go in and get a body cream. I went in the folk store and I got another fine fragrance mist. So I just had a brain fart. So instead of me actually having a set of this, instead I have two fine fragrance mists. But it's all good because coconut is super easy to wear. It makes sense to wear during the summer. So I don't think I'll have any problem like getting through this type of fragrance. Um, this is coconut milk, vanilla rum, and pink hibiscus. And normally, I don't like hibiscus scents, especially, um, what's the one that Bath & Body Works always brings back? Um, the hibiscus one, I can't even think of it. I'll put it on the screen. I don't like that. I know a lot of people lose their mind over that one. I am not a fan. Y'all can have that one. If, if y'all having the last one depends on me going in there and buying it, oh, you gonna get what you want every time because I'm, I'm leaving that at the store. Anyway, <laughs> this next one is going to be a moisturizing body wash. So this has shea butter and cocoa butter. This is in a scent, A Thousand Wishes. And A Thousand Wishes is just so good, so, so good. This has notes of pink Prosecco, sparkling keys, crystal peonies, gilded amber, and amaretto creme. So I've been a fan of A Thousand Wishes for years. Um, I almost passed out when my supervisor recently gifted me um, an early Christmas gift. I made a short, so hopefully you guys were able to see that, but she actually gifted me um, a candle in this particular fragrance, and so I'm like, oh, girl, you got it right. You got it right, and rest assured, I am going to use this gift. I'm going to enjoy this gift. This is not money that's been spent in vain, so Thank you, thank you, thank you, and you know who you are. I absolutely adore A Thousand Wishes. I've been wearing it for years. I will never get tired of it. Um, A Thousand Wishes is sort of like champagne toast for me. I love bright, bubbly, boozy scents, especially if it has like floral in there some sort of way. But anyway, I was lucky enough to find not one, but two, not me putting up four fingers, y'all know what I meant, not one, but two, EDPs and a thousand wishes you guys um, this is the older packaging but so there they are I want to say I got these for like seven bucks and the girl when I took them to the register she was like these are only seven some dollars y'all that's my neighbors out there with that music I'm sorry Lord. so that's what it looks like hope you guys can see that I'm trying to prevent too much of a glare and it's not going to take me long to get through this because I, I really do love this fragrance. So, um, I have this in the Glotion form. I have it in the Fine Fragrance Mist. My supervisor, like I said, she gave it to me in the um, Candle version. Um, I have it in the Fine Fragrance Mist. I have this in the Shampoo and Conditioner. I got all the things. All the things. And a thousand wishes. And... Don't think I'm crazy, y'all. So if I showed you this before, my bad. But this is the Glowing Body Scrub that I got. This is also a Lost Files item. So yeah, it's like that when it comes to A Thousand Wishes. So that actually completes my haul. Thank you so much for joining me. You guys, hopefully I'll be able to get into the store soon and get some um, stuff that's actually, you know, being offered during this SAS. But I just cannot bring myself to paying 
50% off. Like, it's like I'm physically incapable of handing over my debit card. Like, I can't do it. I just can't. I just can't. <laughs> for real, y'all, I can't. Thank you for joining me, you guys. I'll probably upload, like, another short, like, walkthrough video because I did go into the store this week to, like, look around. I went to, like, another store, not, like, my local store. Um, but, yeah, the stuff was 50% off, so... It kind of went from what should have been ultimately a haul video to like a store walkthrough video. And then because I'm random, like I just showed y'all like a reaction to me trying like some wings from Wingstop. Y'all, anyway, if you're interested, check out that video too. But until next time, you guys take care. Again, thank you for tuning in. XO, bye baby dolls.